Hi, this is Life Sky Dragon, and this arc Survival Evolved. I thought I'd throw in a sort of intermediate guide, because um, once you've gone through the beginner stuff, you sort of get to a stage where you got your dinos and that, your basic dinos, and then you're probably looking towards you sort of your rock, or oh, sorry, stone, stone, wooden houses. Which I completely, 100%, definitely go for. Um, I mean, I've put tons of storage in this one, absolutely fuckloads. Um, and got your mortars and pestles and stuff. Um, I even um, threw an extension for a little blacksmith. Which I put a little furnace, a workshop and a couple of storage boxes. Um, I mean... I think I uh, I got fed up with dinos destroying my thatch roof, thatch house. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you where the best place for metal is, which is key um, to the next level as well. I'm just looking on here for the best hills and mountains I've uh, put outposts on a couple of the mountains um, which I uh, have anclos and I'll go collect metal and fly back and forth um, yeah to make more metal ingots and whatnot but it's gonna take Argentavis up because I remember when I first died, um, mail was a very rare thing until I started exploring and I realised there's actually tons of it. See all these hills? That is where your metal is, as you can see. There are plenty of them. Obviously the big mountains and the volcano back there, they have absolutely tons of the stuff. And this is going to help massively, absolutely massively, um, towards the the next level, so to speak. So I'm going to go explore one of these hills for you. The closest one, by land. Um, looking for metal and going on top of these hills with flyers is, well, I found very dangerous to begin with. Um... Especially with flying ants and oh, they're just buggers. And uh, I lost a lot of pterodons and whatnot doing this. So I got myself Rex, found, found myself a nice mountain hill slash hill to climb up. Uh, but yeah, we're going to explore them. And this guy, the Deolysus, and the Castoridus are key for the next level I mean no more mining when I mean no more mining I mean wood and stone because when you set them off to wander they will collect it for you um, I'm talking say you let them wander off into a nice patch of woods or with a nice mountain in 24 hours you'll have thousands of stone and wood. I mean that house there took me eight hours with a simple pickaxe. Eight hours. I don't want anyone going through that. See this guy? This is the reason why. They used to hunt me down, destroy my little thatch house. I was so fed up with it. These big giant turkeys. I spent eight hours building that house. I was mad. I was mega, mega pissed. So I made it my little extension. Just fed up with dying. But as I say, when the um, best thing to do, if you get to that stage where you're dying, you're um, well, if you go looking for your body again and you die, and then you go 
back because you don't want it to decompose and you keep going back and forwards, backwards and forwards. Sometimes it's best to leave it. I find just going back to like the basics. It's like a father. If I die, I'll. I mean, I'll, I'll fill up my compost bins or I'll check my egg pens and oh, I'll see if there's anything close by to tame. Or I'll just do some harvesting. I just find that's. Uh, I find it well relaxing. So, um, <laughs> uh, so yeah, I find because otherwise I won't go on it for days. Because I just get mega pissed of it and f fed up with it. So that's what I like to do anyway. But uh, yeah, we're gonna make our way up this big oh fudge, fucking dilos, fucking dilos, fuck off. God, I hate these guys. Not the most hated, but they're annoying. God, I hate dilos. So that's what I mean. It's, it was about a five minute little journey up to this hill. And there's metal to my right, or in front of us. If we journey on up. Another giant turkey. Oh, I'm fed up with you. Every time I see one, I have to kill one because it just makes me feel better. God, I hate them. This is probably one of the most hated out of everything. That and terror birds. I hate terror birds. What's that? What's that a horse? Looks like a fucking unicorn. It's a unicorn, eh, isn't it? I have to come and look for you later. I mean, I haven't seen a unicorn before. I've seen the is it Equius or. But I haven't seen a fucking unicorn. It so yeah, it's metal, metal. Let's go further up. See, I've put an outpost on top of this hill. So. There's metal, metal. I mean, that's what I personally like to do. I'll just a little two by two little wooden house. And what I'll do is, I'll say, I'll just quickly show you. It's just got a bed in it and a couple of storage boxes. And I'll fill them up with metal until then I'll come back eventually when it all respawns. I mean, this is on a normal server, so it respawns at a normal rate. Which is pretty damn slow. But say so if you you're not very far, you're never very far from a hill or a mountain in this place. I mean I like to I literally park up on a Rex or a Spino and I'll just metal, I'll just I'll just keep picking it and I'll store it in the Rex or whatnot until he's full. And I'll wait until I'm full, and then I'll go back, stick it in my storage box, and fly over and pick it up. Do a couple of, uh, obviously you need a lot of weight on your RG. You need a lot of weight. So the Quitzel is still, well, taking a piss. Uh, I'll save you, Diplo. There you are, buddy. One good deed. Always, it's always nice to do a good deed. Oh, what a fucking oh, arsehole. He's fucking saved you. Now you're trying to eat me. Fucking dick. Some of that. Arsehole. I'll try and save the guy. Fucking turns on me. But no, I've got, um. As I say. I should have, um, I'm going to have future videos on this, um, obviously with the Dodeculus and the Beaver Tames, I'm going to be doing tame videos on them, and some of the yeah, sort of like the next level dinos, uh, sort of like the next tier I find, um, 
So like your next, like your meteors and whatnot. So Ingrams as well. So you got your Trank arrows. Now I'm looking for. There's your metal pick and axe, and your scissors on the very end. They will come very very handy when resource collecting resources. Make a massive difference compared to the simple ones. Now, and then you've got your chin armor, which you, that allow you to get the uh, flak flak armor, which is pretty awesome. And the s sickle as well. That's pretty uh, fiber is pretty awesome. And you've got more chin armor. And what am I looking for? I don't know if I've gone past it. So there's your flak armor. Clear, I don't it's definitely not the strongest armor with the tech tier, but I think it's the strongest you can get. I'm not sure about the ghillie in that. I don't think that's very strong, it's more for for stealth. I think I've gone past it. Um, there we go. The long neck rifle and the long neck rifle ammo. That is massive. It's absolutely a massive upgrade. Instead of using crossbows and arrows. And then you want to get obviously your trank arrows. There he is. They are massive. But they cost so much. I mean you have to to get train carriers you need to get the ammo which also costs metal because you're probably costing you about six metal or something crazy per trank that's what I mean it gets nuts and the long rifle is really expensive well not really expensive but if you start off with I mean I've lost long probably two or three long knit rifles and it drives me mad no, and I've spent all that metal on it and I've just lost it. And if I've got ammo too. Absolutely fucking annoying. But yeah. Hope as I say, hopefully we can get some more uh, some more taming done, say like next tier type dinos. Uh such as like stegos, like the upgrade to the triceratops. I'd say Raptors, well, your Carno, Carnos are your like, upgraded Raptors, uh, like the Rex the Spinos, the upgraded from that sort of thing. Um, and then you've got new dinos such as the like, Anklos, which are great, like mixed uh, resource gatherers, just like general gatherers, which are really amazing. So that is what's coming up next. On the channel, on the well, on this series, but uh, I don't think there's anything I missed, um, dino wise. But I say I'll upload them and then I'll show you the special abilities as well. So I'm just gonna head back. I say it's literally a five minute journey there and back. Well, five minutes there, five minutes back. So you, you're never very far away from metal, which is cool. So you got, I say I'll get the tames done for you, and uh, once we've got that done, I sort of didn't want to go crazy on a uh, intermediate guy, because obviously you guys can build, so I'm not telling you how to build, because, you sh well, you know how to build. <laughs> So, I mean, I've uh, gone and invented other stuff like uh, just quickly park up old Spino, which I'm hoping to do some videos on, <clears throat> such as like pens and stuff like that. Um, I want to do some quick videos on the buildings, um, such as I've got. Well, I've sort of got a little sort of like catcher pen. I with my RG, I like to. That's a troublesome RG, and pissing me off. But yeah, like dropping dinos into these and trapping them, and and I'm also that's 
my Ovis, I'm going to start a farm, which I want to do a farm video. Um, yeah, and it's more of a future sort of thing as well, to say what's coming up next. So this is like a random dino pen with just useful dinos. Um, Ankler, of course, for your metal, your stone, and flint. It's sick, it's absolutely awesome. This guy here is a massive thatch gatherer. And the diabet, he's a wicked fiber uh, collector. He's mad fiber. He collects fiber like by bucket load. And the poop machine, we get the farming done as well, as I said, the crops. Dire wolf's good for chitting and uh, pelts. So we'll get him done. And there's just a couple of crazy, like the baryonics and that, good swimmers. So yeah, I'll do all tames for them. Oh, Lysterious, you're looking sad there, bud. He always looks sad, I noticed. Oh, Lysterious, always sad. And this is a, a Raptor pen. Um, sadly, I didn't create this myself. I actually checked it out for a, another YouTuber, which I thought was really cool. I wanted to do it myself. Um, so I won't be making a video on that. But, um, yeah, up here I've got a... Uh, where are you uh, get my eggs from, which is all my pens, I'm going to do a short, not a short video, but a video on this, um, all the ramps and that, with the Ovi Raptors, so I'll do an Ovi Raptor tame video, but yeah, I've got all different dinos in there, getting eggs, I'll go around cat collecting them all and whatnot, put a video on that as well. In the near future, so yeah, we um, so we'll get there eventually. With all these tames, I'm trying to uh, tame them all, but yeah, we'll get there eventually. We will. So yeah, also the flies as well. I'm gonna try and. Sadly, I've done it before the nerf, so which would be tame purposes. But I'll try and get a video out. But cheers for watching. Cheers, bye.